Us here on Small Town Hunters aren't only after the trophy white-tailed buck. We're also out there to get some meat in the freezer and get to know our family and friends better and enjoy the nature that God has given us. So on this hunt, I'm after a doe that I call Big Mama. She's a big white-tailed deer that I've been after for the past three years. Got a lot of trail camera pictures of her and got a lot of encounters with her. So I just want to thank you guys. Make sure to hit that subscribe button and hopefully you enjoy the video. Mer As you can see, that's Big Mama. She's big and she's a mama. That's the doe that's picked me off twice and picked Paul off once. Well, didn't pick Paul off.
I think I hit her right behind the shoulder. It looked like it. It sounded, I think it sounded good. I don't know, I'm gonna have to rewatch the footage. I'm gonna get down real quick and check the arrow. Stay tuned and hopefully we get a deer down. Just, let's go. Just got down there. I found blood, so that's a good sign. We're gonna get pack up. Uh, I'm gonna get packed up, get to the house again, talk to the guys, and figure out a game plan. All right, guys. So I thought I'd update you. This is actually the next day. We never took the camera out for the tracking job because we thought we'd just find it right away. But the thing is, when I shot, it got double lung, kind of sliced open the diaphragm, guts kind of poured into her lungs, and this is the exit. So it's a rage broadhead, the hypodermic. I shot two deer with the same broadhead. This is the shoulder line, hit a little bit far back, but I'm kind of confused how it went in and hit the guts. That was weird. So, yeah, we ended up finding her about 150 yards away from where I shot her. She ran through the field, got over, and then she crossed the road and then came back, and then she died right by the road. She crossed the road, came back, and then died right on the road. We walked an extra 200 yards because we lost blood, but the thing is, we didn't really lose blood. Like, she didn't stop bleeding. It's just that she turned completely around and we just caught the thought that she kept going straight. So we ended up seeing like four more deer while tracking. So that's pretty good. We still have a lot more deer around here. I'm going to try to get my mom out there hunting, trying to get a deer. I'm going to start filming more people. I still have a buck take, so I'm going to hold off and try to get a big buck, especially that 11 point that I just got on trail camera. So if you guys like more videos like this, make sure to like, comment, subscribe, and please do me a favor and go hit that subscribe button. It'd be very awesome. Um, we think she weighs around 140. She's a pretty big butt doe. Um, I'd guess that she's around four, four or five. She's an old doe. I think I saw her last year. We got a lot of trail cameras, on, uh, trail camera pictures on her. I hunted her for a straight week and a half to get this specific deer, and I ended up getting it done. So, if you guys like videos like this, make sure to hit that subscribe button and hit the like button, and also go down and hit me up with some comments. And we plan on doing more videos every week. So make sure to like, comment, subscribe. I'll catch you guys all in the next one. Thanks for watching.